Okay, so just picking up the hire car, going to the wrong side. Um, filled the contract in. The thing is now, I'm on my own. The left hand side of the car. I have no idea really how to get back to the hotel. I should have left bread on the way or something. And I've got to try and navigate around Ibiza to get back to the hotel to find Lewis. Okay, the pizza's arrived. Not sure what Lois is eating, but I've got my lunch sorted. <laughs> Had lunch, pizzeria, Spanish pizza, lovely. Saw that. Very thin pineapple, ham was nice. Thin base, just what we needed for lunch. And now we're going towards what I think must be the castle. So. Looks like the castle. So you can pause this and read that. So I'm not going to read it to you. And this is where we're going. sort of right on the top of Ibiza at the moment. Okay, we have no idea where we are. We're in Ibiza or Ibiza. Ibiza. We walked towards what we thought was a castle. It's something to do with old sort of fort or oh. something. What? Something just went in there. Lois has just been scared by a lizard. So we started walking up, come through those lovely little beautiful houses and stuff, the one for sale. And uh, this is what we've still got to do. Quite high. I wish I'd bought the drone. Uh, okay, this is probably worth it. This is a view then of the southern tip of Ibiza. Lovely. It's a beautiful view, well worth the walk up the hill. Just wish there was someone to get a drink. Found a drinks machine, decided I'm not paying any more than two euros. Let's see how much it is. Two euros. Two euros, bargain. It would be pretty amazing, we think, to live on this island. And not only on this island, but within this sort of fort. The houses are absolutely stunningly beautiful. Yeah, they're old, but they've been here for three or four hundred years. I mean, look at this place behind me. There's a bird cage. No bird. There's no bird. Must be dead. So going up was fine. Coming down is a bit of a problem. Our flip-flops and these smooth, shiny stones don't mix very well. Lots of tourists walking around, holding onto the wall, slipping over. Like it? Best drink you've had all day? Hello. Oh, good boy. You're cute. Oh. <laughs> Just these, please. Oh, we're okay for a bag. It's fine. Thank you. Okay, we're back from Ibiza town at the car. The car is boiling. It's like 26 degrees. Next stop, I think it's Illa Esvedra. I'll show it to you on a map. Vedra, that's how I think we see it. So we've got time here, we'll probably have dinner nearby. There's a restaurant down the road that Lois has seen, I didn't see it, but she seems to think it's expensive. Which means we probably will be eating it. Um, we're just going to try and capture this thing, I'll let you see it. Pretty beautiful. 
Telefon. Vedros is pretty cool. I don't know how far out it is, but I flew the drone two and a half kilometers and didn't touch on it. You can see the footage in this. People seem to be attracted to it. And I, um, I landed it and turned around and there's a crowd of about four or six people stood there staring She's at me staring like this. Staring at her. Okay, so we're in Santa Ana um, and we're here to have dinner and watch the sunset. It's supposed to be the best sunset in Ibiza. And here drinking some champagne. And Cafe Mambo is just off the road. I think this is the best place to come in Ibiza. Party central. So dinner in San Antonio is a lamb kebab in a pit of bread. We demolished that before we switched the camera on. Some fries. Lois has got another champagne with some random strawberry in it. I've got another Coke. I'm driving. Sun's making its way down, still probably an hour off.